Alright, what's up guys? So, I saw this tweet and yeah, I, I agree with it. I 100% I agree with it. I believe that Activision put way too much time and unwanted effort into Warzone that it really did distract the developers of what Call of Duty actually is. Like, you don't see them really focusing on campaign. You don't really see them focusing on multiplayer. They just pretty much slapped in uh, zombies with Warzone. And, yeah, it's like, it, it's, not, it's not what Call of Duty once was. Like, hopefully with this next Call of Duty, they just leave Warzone um, its own thing. But they make Black Ops... Six, I think that's what I don't know if it's gonna be called Black Ops Six or Black Ops something else at the end of it, but they need to just have it where Call of Duty is Call of Duty and Warzone is Warzone. Pull a H1Z1, just have it where it's like, yeah, Warzone is just get rid of that Call of Duty name, but have it where uh, there is a team just focused on Warzone. So for those that do like Warzone, okay, but you need to have a team that is 100% focused on on call of duty because if not then yeah it's just gonna be call of duty after call of duty after call of duty getting bad reviews after bad reviews after bad reviews i'm saying like i get that there is a strong fan base when it comes to warzone but i feel like yeah you might have some people out there that uh do play solo but i feel like the majority of the people that do like playing um warzone is probably yeah like a group of friends or something you know and uh or maybe content creators but i feel like for the most part it, it's just warzone ain't really people i feel like people are playing it because that's really the only thing that's active that it's like you know yeah there might be that one store that brought us like so many memories like toys or like all right so yeah if i, I guess if i could put in an example you know we got well, we had stores like Toys R Us, and it's like, obviously, you know, that's gonna, I was like, always be the better option. I have to say, Toys R Us is like OG Call of Duty, and then Warzone today, it's like Amazon. You know, it's just, it's the option where it's like, okay, you're gonna see that more than a Toys R Us. So I'm just saying, it's like, yeah, it's like, if you guys want that, like, Toys R Us to be successful, then it's like, bro, you're gonna have to do some things with it, but it's like, it can't be successful if you still like like it's like i guess if they still had it or like they had like a toys r us store on amazon or something i'm like yeah that's a somewhat okay option but at the same time i think people would just like the og feel of what you know toys r us but getting back to you know the the main uh subject i'm talking about call of duty i think everybody's gonna like that og call of duty and it's like they tease it but then they just go right back to um focusing on warzone and i'm like bro people not everybody plays warzone i can tell you that right now i don't play i know the thing is this it's not so much as that i don't play i can't play because every time when i do try to play i try to play solo can't go into a solo game. Then it's like, try uh, playing one of the other games. Can't play those games. I'm like, okay, then what's the point of this game existing if I can't play it? So I'm like, either work on the servers or work on something. But I'm just saying, like, it, it to me, it just don't make any sense where it's like, you put so much time and effort and focusing on Call of Duty Warzone. But it's like, bruh, not, for one, not everybody plays Call of Duty Warzone. I guarantee and I promise you, you got some zombie fans. You got, like, them co-op fans, like the co-op mode that they had in the uh, first Call of Duty. Not very first Call of Duty Modern Warfare, but, like, the newer Modern Warfare. You got people that like that. You got people that like campaign. You got people that will play, like, an offline multiplayer. Kind of like how uh, Battlefield 2042, like, how they got, like, their single-player multiplayer thing. But you probably got some people out there that do that. But it's like, fam everybody's not gonna want to play warzone okay i'm just gonna tell you that right now there's other modes and other things that people are gonna want to play so i'm saying even if you guys got pulled some uh whatchamacallit some Fortnite stuff and have it where the uh the audience get to create their own um game modes and maps and all that stuff do that but i'm saying though it's like you you guys gotta do something to where with this next call of duty you guys gotta do something where it really does give back to the fans but not no season passes not no battle passes none of that stuff no a game that feels like a genuine old call of duty game okay like none of that new stuff because that new stuff don't work all right so but anyways with that being said i will talk to y'all later thank you guys for watching like subscribe if you're new to the channel and peace